Well, looks like we are uh, set to go. Green flags out. Here we go. Heat race for the IMCA Fox 620 Sport Compacts. Down the front stretch they go. 15 to Tyler Thompson takes the top spot. Derek Boggs up the inside of the 31 machine. A lot of smoke trailing from that 15 of Thompson. But Thompson awful fast early on here in heat race uh, for the Fox 620 Sport Compacts. Battle for second, shaping up with Derek Boggs and the 13B of David Bates. Bates a little loose up on the top side of the speedway. Going to lose some ground as Luke Jackson trying to reel him in in the sixth car. But up front, it's all Tyler Thompson in the 15. Thompson continues to lead. Boggs, Bates, Jackson, and Newsom, your top five. Luke Jackson takes a look at the inside of the 13B of Bates as they roll through turns three and four. Bates a better line through the corner this time. Pulls right back up to the back of the box machine. Meanwhile, half straightaway advantage for Tyler Thompson. But look at the battle for a second. All the, together they go. Jackson on the inside. Look out, a little bit of contact. Bates going to cross over, trying to get to the inside of the speedway. Bates takes back third over Jackson. Boggs, Bates, Jackson. Here comes Jake Newsman joining the battle as well. Four cars. Boggs way up the speedway in turn four. Might allow Bates to get by, but they're still side by side for positions two and four. Bates and Boggs doing a little rubbing in turn one. Jackson and Newsom right there as well. But out front, Tyler Thompson cruising on a Saturday night. Way out front in the 15 machine. Looks like that smoke has trailed off as well. A little puff of smoke there off turn four, but Tyler Thompson still your leader in the 15. Bates, Boggs, Jackson, Newsom, your top five. Boggs and Jackson still bound for that third spot. Jake Newsom in that battle as well. Out front, Tyler Thompson is G-O-N-E. He gone as the white flag is out. One to go for your race leader, the 15 of Tyler Thompson. Second to 13 to David Bates, but look at the battle for third as Boggs, Newsom, and Jackson all right together on the speedway. Newsom and Jackson still battling now for the four spot off turn number two. Through turns three and four, one final time here in the heat race for your Fox 620 Sport Compacts. Your heat race winner is the 15 of Tyler Thompson. Second to the 13 of Bates. Third at the line, the 31 of Boggs. Newsom, Jackson, the 61A, the 69V, and the 14 of Cheyenne McCulley. Wrap up your field here in heat race for your Fox 620 Sport Compacts. Fox 620 is Stu Lance home for local sports news. Fox 620, your sports show, and Curtis Anderson, the place for sports. Sometimes I feel I've got to. Lights are out. We're set to go. Green flag here at the IMCA Race Seaver Model Sprint Cars. The 05 of Colin Smith works that outside. He takes the top spot, brings along the 7L of Jesse Lindbergh with him. Brandon Stevenson third, getting challenged from Casey Abbas in the 17 machine. The 81 of Jared Jansen, the 051 is Nate Eakin. But up front, it's all Colin Smith in the 05. Colin Smith holding down the top spot. Brandon Stevenson loose off turn two. He's going to lose a couple of spots. Move Stevenson back to fifth. Smith currently second in points in the 0-5 machine. Got a big advantage over Jesse Lindbergh in the 7L. Casey Abbas rolling around third in the 17L machine, B machine. Heat race here for the IMCA 305 race receivers with Colin Smith, your leader. Battle shaping up in the three and four. Look out, slider on an eight Eakin in the 0-5-1 machine. Eakin takes over the fifth spot from Brandon Stevenson. Stevenson back on the inside trying to take back the fifth spot, but can't make it stick. As your leader comes off turn four, it's the 0-5 of Colin Smith. Field starting to get stretched out now here around Park Jefferson Speedway. Mike Stegena. The 35 machine falling back. Could fall to the clutches of Colin Smith, your leader. Smith could put him a lap down here in the closing laps. Colin Smith, very strong in a 0-5. Going to put Stegenga a lap down. 
As the white flag waves, one to go for Colin Smith. Jesse Lindbergh holding down a second spot. Casey Abbott's third. Off turn four, checkered flag out. Colin Smith getting the heat race win ahead of Jesse Lindbergh. Casey Abbott's the 17V, the 81 of Jared Jensen, and the 051 of Nate Eakin. So Colin Smith, the 05 machine. Coming off turn four down the front stretch. That is your heat race winner. That's the 05 of Colin Smith. You might notice the 051 machine looks very similar. Well, you'll uh, see a small number one next to the 05. That's the 05 out of Okoboji of Nate Eakin coming here down the front stretch. Green flag waves the Fox 620 Sport Compacts as uh, Jake Newsom on the inside, Tyler Thompson outside. There, your front row, Luke Jackson and Derek Boggs side by side. Here comes David Bates for the uh, battle for the third spot. Jake Newsom, little sideways, the bottom of turns three and four. Not able to complete the pass as Tyler Thompson going to lead lap number one. Thompson, Newsom, Jackson, Boggs, your top four. David Bates down the back stretch, falling off back of the pack. Look out, got a car sideways. Luke Jackson getting contact, goes around. Gets her straightened back out. We're going to stay clean and green, but goodness, lots of contact. Everybody getting her straightened out. 61A car having some uh, that right front tire not pointing the right direction. Looks like he's going to take that car pit side. Meanwhile, your leader's off into turns three and four. Tyler Thompson, the 15's your leader. He's got Jake Newsom in his tire tracks. Thompson and Newsom pulling away from the field here in the Fox 620 Sport Compact main event. Bates in the 13B showing some damage. Look out. Got a car in the loose stuff outside of turns three and four. Got one up against the inside wall. Looks like that's the 14C of Cheyenne McCauley up against the inside wall there. Next to turn four. Caution on the speedway. Out front in the 15 machine. Jake Newsom and David Bates side by side in the second row. Luke Jackson, Derek Boggs in that third row as the green flag waves. We go racing once again in the IMCA Sport Compact Division, brought to you by Fox 6 Sports 620. Bates with a good run off of the turn one. Look out, Luke Jackson beating and banging. Bates beating and banging. But three wide for the second spot. Out front, it's Tyler Thompson, but Jackson, Newsom, Bates, Boggs all right together on the speedway. Derek Boggs, all kinds of squarely in three and four, but gets it straightened out as Tyler Thompson continues to lead over Jake Newsom. Thompson, Newsom, Jackson, Bates, one, two, three, and four. Bates with a good runoff turn two, takes a peek to the outside of Luke Jackson down the back stretch, but falls back in line. Still a little bit of smoke trailing from both the 15 and the 423, but both cars still continue to be very fast here in the feature event for the Fox 620 Sport Compacts. Newsom comes down the hill, a little bit shorter line around the speedway, trying to get back to the rear bumper of Tyler Thompson's 15 machine. Thompson and Newsom beginning to pull away from Luke Jackson and David Bates. Newsom looks to the inside of Tyler Thompson. Here he comes down the front stretch. Thompson still with a slight advantage at the line. But Newsom looks up the inside, trying to get around the 15 of Tyler Thompson. Thompson, Newsom, Jackson, Bates, Boggs, your top five. Bates tries to slide down the hill, take a little look at the inside of the sixth of Jackson, but can't make it stick. Two to go for your race long leader, the 15 of Tyler Thompson. Thompson, Newsom, Jackson, Bates, Boggs, your top five. This time by Gary's got the big bed sheet out. One to go for your race leader, Tyler Thompson. Oh, 
Thompson leads Jake Newsom. Luke Jackson, David Bates, Derek Boggs, your top five. Newsom going to make one more run at the leader, but off turn four, checkered flag out. Your race winner, the 15 of Tyler Thompson. Jake Newsom, Luke Jackson, David Bates, Derek Boggs, your top five. Tyler Thompson heading back to victory lane of the Fox 620 Sport Compacts. Fox 620 is Siouxland's home for local sports news. Fox 620, your sports show. And Curtis Anderson, the place for sports. Lights are on, run a speedway, 12 laps to distance for the 305 IMCA race receiver sprint cars as we go green. Colin Smith working bottom side of the speedway. Jesse Lindbergh up top. Smith takes the advantage down the back stretch. Lindbergh right there in his tire tracks. As Smith again to the bottom. Lindbergh up top. Off turn number four. Colin Smith leads lap one. Smith on the bottom. Lindbergh up top. Lindbergh keeping it wound up as much as he can. Back to the push bar of the 0-5 of Smith. Top two cars. Got one looped around in turn two. That's the 35 machine. Caution on the speedway. Caution for the 35 of Mike Stegna. As 35 had looped around, kind of did one of those double pirouettes with a twist, but couldn't keep it rolling. But the lights go out, and we're set to go once again. The 05 machine of Colin Smith is set to bring the field back to the green. Gary's giving him the eagle eye. Green flag's out. Here we go. Great start for Colin Smith in the 05. Pulls the advantage down the front stretch into turn one and a big run off turn two. As Lindbergh tried that lower line in one and two, it didn't find it to his liking as he lost a bunch of ground to Smith at the front of the field. Lindbergh again to the top side in turns one and two. Losing ground to Colin Smith in the 05 as Smith is very strong her early on in the IMCA race receiver 305 main event. Smith continues to lead over Lindbergh. Lindbergh falling back to the clutches of Casey Abbas in the 17 machine. But up front, it's all Colin Smith in the 05. Lindbergh slowly reeling in the 05 machine of Smith. That's that top side. Seems to be suiting the 7 machine. Of course, as I say that, he falls back to Casey Abbas through three and four. As the 7L of Lindbergh seems to get a good run through one and two, but not quite as strong in three and four. Which leaves Colin Smith up front holding down that top spot as we're halfway home this time by. Casey Abbas working the bottom side of the speedway. Takes over that second spot as Jesse Lindbergh still trying to work the top side down. 35 slows down the front stretch. He'll pull into the infield. Meanwhile, Casey Abbas has caught the 0-5 of Colin Smith. Abbas within a car length to Smith, but Smith getting a good bite off turn two. Opens up about a three car length advantage. Jesse Lindbergh joining the battle as well. But Colin Smith continues to hold down the top spot. Battle for second again down the back stretch as Abbas had trouble off two. Abbas on the bottom, Lindbergh up top, but up front it's all Colin Smith in the 05. <laughs> Colin Smith holding down the top spot. Casey Abbas second, JC Lindbergh third. The 0 51 and 8 Eakin running out your top four. As Colin Smith a big advantage with two to go. Smith, Abbas, Lindbergh, Eek in your top four, Stevenson, and the 81 machine of Jared Jansen rounding out the field. White flag in the air, one to go for Colin Smith. <laughs> Through 
returns three and four. One final time, IMCA race C remain event of the evening goes to your new point leader, the 0-5 of Colin Smith. Casey Abbas second, Jesse Lindbergh third, Nate Eakin rounding out your top four. But that's how you get it done. You pick up the feature win and you take over the point lead. Your new point leader and your feature winner tonight in the IMCA Race Receiver 305 Sprints to 05 machine. That is Colin Smith.